Hey everyone! Today we have a box from SQ Arcade. Let's open her up. A USB trackball for arcade cabinets. We didn't get any instructions with it. I guess it's supposed to be plug and play. So it's blue and it spins. From what I can tell, there's a fair amount of friction on the ball. I think some people may like that. I've had this sitting on the shelf for a few months, and the thing that concerned me about this was these loose wires. MRL. I messaged the company and they gave an answer. And here's my reply. The only Pandora box I know that supports this is the DX. So this is the arcade version with a jammer edge. It's blue. We can see at the back we have a USB port. We can use a thumbstick or a micro SD with a reader here. With this we don't need to open our box each time we want to change our games. Thanks, Jay. If we check the other side, there's another USB port. It says trackball. Mmm. Okay, it's just marketing. Or is it? We'll check in a bit. On the back we have air holes and also four screws if you want to get to the inside board. Here is the Pandora CX. In our top 10 list we mentioned it's very similar to the DX. But if we look around the box there are no USB ports at all. So to change the games we'd have to unscrew the whole thing, pull out that micro SD and then fiddle with the files. Three screws on the back. So, let's plug it in. In my crystal ball, I see blue balls. Let's move on to the DX with a bit of centipede. Unsure if you can tell, but there's a lot of friction on this blue ball. Crystal Castles. I used to have this on the Amstrad. I loved it. On the Amstrad. Golden Tea. Golf? Nothing. No response. Marble Madness. 3A. Why did you install the Sega Mega Drive version? Ah, deja vu. Centipede 2? Um. Millipede. Rampart. Strata bowling. Liberator. So I don't know why they put this on here. Maybe it's for the trackball. Nope. There are a few absolute classics missing from the DX. I'm just going to copy a few over. 
but we're limited to only MAME 2003, which means no cable, no Blades of Steel, no Simpsons Bowling, eh. Hey, now we're talking. For all of these games, it seems that the trackball is either not sensitive enough, or the MAME settings are just a bit off. Missile Command. Pretty sure this was in Terminator 2. <laughs> and Golden Tea. We can connect it to the computer via the USB cable. We can move the mouse pointer, but it's not sensitive at all. So, as the DX uses MAME, let's try fiddling with some settings. Increase the sensitivity. Test it. Once happy with the settings, we will copy the CFG file over to the micro SD for the DX and ah, much better. Do we recommend using a Pandora DX and trackball like this? <laughs> Not really. The DX is too limited by the games it can run. Using a PC, Pi, or an emulic Android box you'd have much better trackball compatibility. There's even a mount for these. So, did you live through the heyday of arcade trackball games? Please comment down below. And, hmm, I wonder if this works on the DX. Let's give it a shot. <laughs> 